Alcoholic cardiomyopathy, ACM, or alcohol-induced heart failure. ACM is a form of heart muscle disease caused by long-term, heavy alcohol consumption. It is characterized by weakening and enlargement of the heart muscle, especially the left ventricle, leading to heart failure. To diagnose ACM, the patient must not have any other cause for their heart failure, such as tachyarrhythmias or primary valvular pathology, and should have normal coronary arteries. Additionally, they should have been consuming 80 to 90 grams of alcohol daily, equivalent to 8 to 10 beers or 1 liter of wine, for at least 10 to 15 years. Here is an example case of alcoholic cardiomyopathy. A 58-year-old man presents with severe exertional breathlessness to the point that he could not continue his job. He was on no medications, and this was his echocardiogram on presentation. As we can see, his left ventricle is enlarged and severely impaired, and he has severe mitral regurgitation. He admitted he was drinking 60 beers a week for the past 40 years, which amounts to roughly 41,000 liters of beer and about 1,200 kilograms of ethanol. His heart rhythm and coronary arteries were normal. With the diagnosis of ACM, he was started on heart failure treatment and abstained from alcohol. 12 months later, his LV size and function were nearly normal, and there was barely any mitral regurgitation. This case serves as a reminder of the toxic effects of alcohol on the cardiac tissue and shows that alcoholic cardiomyopathy can be reversible if the patient immediately starts medical treatment and totally abstains from alcohol. Please visit this link for further information. Thank you for your attention.